Donna says any nose hair trimmers in his shop? My psychic nose hair trimmers. I'd rather not. Excuse me? Oh, you don't want to stay? Hi! Agent Bull? I got some visitors here who are really excited to. Ah! I said one! I only needed one B! Shoo! Shoo! Get out of here! I got extra. They seem friendly. Oh no! Don't all talk at once, please! I can't take it! I can't! It's too much! Too much! Oh no! Don't explode! And don't explode me. Agent Bull? Ah! Want me to kill those bees? No! Like with fire, maybe. It's totally not a problem. Please, don't hurt them. What's wrong? Too many voices. Too many everything. Would you mind if I made a quick and very quiet, uh, wellness check inside your mind? Ah! Scream once for yes, I may enter your mind, and twice for no. Ah. Great. Out of my way, bees. No, not yet. I'm not ready. Cassie's not here. Not ready for what? Dinner. Uh-oh. Let me guess. We're on the menu? No. Worse. Judgment. Court is in session. Please remain standing. If you're able. Touch a judge's gavel! Almost had it. I just... Let's take a five-minute recess. Oh, oh no, 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 no! Anything but this. It's time for... Ram it down! Good evening, and welcome to Ram it Down. I'm your host, Tin Can Zanotto. And tonight, we'll watch one lucky contestant prepare three increasingly complicated dishes in an attempt to please our celebrity judges. Impossible! He'll never do it. He's nothing without Cassie. <laughs> and he's the nice one. <laughs> well, let's get to our first dish, a tragic delicacy from a troubled nation. A Grulovian drowned egg. Ooh. First, our contestant will have to find a very outspoken egg. Oh, me! Pick me! 
Boil it in hot water. I'm all fired up and ready to go. Prepare it with an unruly onion. He said my name! That's been sliced into pieces. Just call me Pork Chopper. Put them both together on a plate and see if the judges can bear two. Ram it down! Finish your dish before the clock runs out and you'll win valuable prizes from the Mystery Box. What do you say? Think you're up to the challenge? Sounds easy. We got this. Right, partner? Partner? Yeah, what was I expecting? And Chef has the egg. Let's see if he remembers what to do with it. I can't Careful wait that to get cooked. Melt those goggles right off you. Pot never boils. Onion acquired. You won't be sorry. Let's see if he makes the cut. I'm ready for the knife. See what he does while that egg is boiling.
Let's see if he can get it to the plate. He's assembled all his ingredients. If Chef would just hit that button, we can begin the presentation. Did we make it? I, I'm not sure. We'll find out, I suppose. Well, here we are, at the moment of truth. Will we be looking at a drowned day or a drowned contestant? Reveal! The meal! So, what we did was, we took an egg... Boring! ...and we popped it into the water... Pedestrian! Uh, then, uh, then Chef had the idea to uh, withhold the salt at just the right moment to create a sense of, uh, longing within the yolk, if you will. You what? We think it really improves the nose feel of the composition. Hmm, compelling. Bone Abbot. <laughs> Surprisingly acceptable. And that's not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box. Well, don't just stand there resting on your laurels. That one was a gimme. Let's see how you do on your next dish. Shoo! Congratulations! You did it! How does it feel? Um, well... Fantastic! Well, get ready, because it's time for your next dish! Right after this commercial message. So before I push that button and start the next dish, let's take a breather, okay? Good idea. Button and get cooking again. Uh, I think 
I hear some emotional baggage now. There's some emotional baggage there. Yeah. 
Start the next round. I'll take this one.
Bon. Jim Pool, you can do it. Next one won't be so easy. You got that right. For your next dish, you'll be creating a strawberry jam croque madame. Ooh la la! You'll need to boil another egg. <laughs> easy. Take some bread. I've already risen to the occasion. Slice it up. Bread's much nicer once it's been through the slicer. And fry it up on the griddle. I'm getting ready to rip it flip out. Uh, well, what about the strawberry, huh? Hey. <laughs> Glad you asked. We'll need not just any strawberry, but a strawberry that's been blended. Did someone call for patty puree? All right, monsieur. It's time to show us your best madame. I wonder which ingredient he'll select first. Walk in the kitchen, please. Especially with that. Yep. Ah, you won't be disappointed. Looking for the perfect blend? Be careful. I lost an arm in there once. Once a goat tastes human flesh, well, it changes the relationship. Quick moving blades, razor sharp. What could possibly go on? Hey! I hear you! I'm lighter than. That's not right. Ever heard the expression? Okay, he's placed the ingredient. Will he be able to pull back the pork chopper's action hoof? Great! Once he pushes that button, our chopping check is now clear. That bread needs to get fried. <laughs> Now that he's sliced the bread, Chef just needs to fry it up. You wanna grill it? I got your skillet!
We only have five more seconds. Oh, oh sorry, I, I missed you. Multitasking. That doesn't smell right. Man, it's cold in here now that I'm sliced. to say for yourself. We have uh, attempted to infuse this dish with... Um... Curiosity and resilience. The more sensitive palates among you will also discern just a dash of regret. <laughs> Slightly better than a mouthful of nails. That's not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box! Now, be gone! And bring us more food! Well, you two must be feeling great after producing such a quality product for our judges. And speaking of quality products, it's time for a word from one of our sponsors. I do without you. How would you feel about taking a little break before I push that button to start the next dish? That's just what the doctor ordered. Thank you. 
help each other. I'd better hit that button and start the next dish. Start the next round. Oh. That's it. I think I've collected every figment in this mine. We might just get through this. Oh, I hope I didn't just jinx it. Me too, because it's time for our third and final dish. Straight from the Lumber Stack Diner, it's the Honey Pepper Pancake Stacker. You'll need another egg. We're old friends. He boiled my dad and grandfather. Oh, but this time that egg needs to fry. Then I'm your guy. Ribbon. Next. You'll need a boar. I'm just a pig, but trust me, I'm game! Get it? Whatever, as long as that pig gets sliced. That's a little sick, man. And fry! Wait, I gotta pull a double shift? To give our pancake stack that signature beehive look, you're going to be using an actual beehive. Woohoo, I'm all a buzz! I wish Cassie were here to handle those bees. But wait, there's more. The final touch of summery sweetness comes from a watermelon. It's about time. That's been chopped. Sure, I guess. Uh, kind of still thinking about that pig, though. And then blended. Oh. <laughs> Looks like I'm the big finish. No pressure, but this is Ford Cruller's favorite dish. To mess this up would be an insult to the very heart of the Psychonauts. Yeah. So, chefs, better get cooking.
You know, we might just get through. Let me slice that melon for you. <laughs> Ingredient in position. Now we must quickly grab the pork chopper's hook. Quick moving blades, razor sharp. What could possibly be? Got it! Quick! That watermelon is still a little chunky. Better bring it to the blender, shall we? Come over here, melon! in this dish. We're moving the hive! Somebody get the queen! I hear the bubbles tickle when you're getting boiled! Oh, I can feel it's helping my lower back already! Could work a miracle. They said I never fly. Look at me now, haters. Come on, let's. <laughs> to tune this oh. Careful, that's hot. Yep. Chef needs to fry that egg now. Careful with that. Looks ready. Now, he just has to get it back to the serving plate. 30 seconds to go. I don't want to... Well, for better or worse, it looks like the dish is assembled. Just push the button. Lumber stack! Lumber stack! 
Have I mentioned that when prepared improperly, the honey pepper pancake stamps can produce an interesting byproduct? No, I didn't mention the possibility of a deadly swarm of killer bees. Ah, no matter. Let's see what we got. Reveal! The meal! <gasps> Is that the tallest stack you could manage? It's taller than it looks. Because we put the literal height of the horizontality of the flavor profile, if you will. <laughs> Moderately pleasant. That's not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box! Well, Chef, it looks like you've won over not just our judges, but also our audience. How do you feel? I, uh, well, I, I, I couldn't have done it without this young man here. No way! You can totally do this on your own now, Agent Bull. No, don't say that. That's great to hear. Because it's time for... What, audience? Double Down! No! That's right. It's time to double down. Chef will be cooking alone in our isolation station completely dependent on his sous chef to gather the ingredients he needs for the final three dishes. Don't worry, Agent Bull. I'll get you all the ingredients you need. What do you think, judges? Ready for another course? No problem. We're... Mm. professionals. Uh, we might have to uh, make a little room. Okay, first dish is vegetable medley. Ingredients on the board. I'm getting out of here before things get messy. More in the Please stay clear of the goat wretch for us. Oh, that's not... Oh, no. He's got the wrong ingredient again. Is anybody even listening to me? Hey, I can really use a side now, now. Hey! Side Delicious. Oh, I hate to see that. I have to close my eyes. Look out! Oh, I, I wouldn't touch that if I were you. I better eat a side pot before I run out of mental energy. Ooh, thank you for the mental energy Run! Attack. Ow. Uh, 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 Touching that regurgitated matter. It can't be good for you, and it must be unthinkably warm. We need to serve the judges, Chef, not attack them. Please don't play with that. Goat vomit is not a is a strong word. Perfect choice. But is it too late? <laughs> you goats must barf. Why not barf out in the air? Watch it. 
Why are you touching that regurgitated matter? It can't be good for you, and it must be unthinkably warm. That goat is charging! Can the Susan uh, get his partner what he needs? Uh, what do you think, audience? Uh, Quickly, sort through the partially digested bounty and find me my ingredient. Ooh, looks like he's got a good one, relatively speaking. Just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Please stay clear of the goat wretch forest. One of those disgusting ones might hold the key to our victory. Well, it's about time you found one of those. Oh, the final ingredient. Now I just have to make this dish all by myself. I shall certainly try. You stay safe down there while I do my best. He did it! We did it! As you know, in the double down round, the chef's assistant must serve the dish to the judges. Let's see if this young man has a passion for service. I'm gonna have to <laughs> oh, it looks like our judge liked that dish. Perhaps a little too much. <laughs> oh, but it looks like someone's ready to get back in the mix. Ah, it's gonna be messy. I'm out of here. Second dish is Royal Borscht. Good luck. Oh, please tell me this batch has the ingredient for you. It seems like the sous chef has picked up the wrong end. That's the ticket. Show yourself, Bork. Oh, oh I, I wouldn't touch that if I were. <laughs> Like it in here. Oh, here comes some fresh candidates. Oh, I would hope this is not a word. They look warm. Exactly what the chef wanted. Thank you. Come on, I know you go take some eggs or. Mm. Oh, I, I won't touch that. I do. Oh, I hate to see that. I'm going to close my eyes. Oh, you never want to see how the food really gets made, do you? Oh, please tell me this batch has the ingredient for you. Perfect. Don't eat this. Wrong. Finally. Oh, yes, I'll take it from here. Bring him to mom. Easy. Go to Rich. Go to Rich. 
Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. It looks incredible. But if the judges say it's inedible, serve it before it gets up and walks away. All right, let's see if our second judge can exercise a little more moderation. Uh oh, someone's been overserved. <laughs> and it looks like they're getting ready to flip out. But our final dish is no laughing matter. Mess up these jam tarts, and you'll find yourself in a sticky situation. <laughs> A slight whiff of vomit on this one, but I'll cover it up with spice. If I could just trouble you for a watermelon, young man. Ingredients are so nice, he's using them twice. Heavens, more ingredients. I don't want this. No offense. Exactly the thing. Hurry now. Oh, excellent. Are we going to get a strawberry? Bachelor attack! One of those disgusting lumps might hold the key to our victory. Why are you playing with that? I don't want that. We don't need one of those right now. Here we go. That's the last eat, ingredient. Eat, 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 I, I don't want to taste eat, it, but eat, I feel eat, like eat. this one will be my best one yet. Eat, 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 in a minute. Well, who are these jammy fellows? Serve them quickly, young man. You never know what these tongues might do. Run for the hills, folks! Well, I don't know about you, but I've certainly had my fill of excitement today. All right, everybody, let's clean up this mess. Aww. Come on, get a move on. Clean kitchen, clean mind. Ah, uh, you see, this is why I usually get takeout.
<laughs> that is so Cassie. But what do you mean they won't let her out? What librarian? Hmm. Here, my boy. You've earned this. I need to go find Cassie right away. Lost? We'll never get lost. I know that forest like the back of my hand. Wait! Don't you want... help? Hmm. Guess he doesn't. With this Senior League pass, I can get to Agent Crawler in the bowling alley and try to reconnect that aspect of his mind. The bowling aspect. Too hard in yourself, kid. It's a mess in there. Hmm. Is it time to take a spin in the brain tumbler? Yes, I'm ready to go. The budget of this show has been cut drastically. You might say it was chopped. <laughs> but they kept that guy. Weird. Oh, here's the steamer trunk tag. Compton's mind is sorted. Emotionally speaking, I mean. 